Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very exciting video for you. It is a collaboration with the beautiful Brittany Rosette, or Britta's Beauty, which I'm sure a lot of you guys know her as. So today we have decided to collaborate and do a top 20 summer essentials video. And today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my top 20, which is half makeup and half just regular summer essentials. So if you guys don't know, Brittany does have a YouTube channel and also an amazing Instagram, which I will link in the description box box down below. Go send her some love as well. Subscribe to her channel and go follow her on Instagram because she has a really good Instagram page. So I would highly recommend you guys checking her out and I know you guys will love her as well if you haven't seen her already. So again, I will have all of her details down below and today I'll be sharing with you guys a couple of my makeup favorites and my essentials for summertime. So hopefully you guys enjoy and if you guys want to see my essentials then just keep watching. Okay guys, so starting off with makeup. Today I have been doing a, I actually did all of my makeup with everything that I'll be showing with you guys today. So if you guys want to know what's on my face, I have used just these products. So exciting stuff. So the first thing that I used was a primer. This one is by Seventeen. It is a UK brand. I did pick it up from the UK, but you can also purchase it on eBay or online. So this is by the brand Seventeen. It is the Skin Wow 10 Liquid Glow Instant Glow. Um, it is just a really lovely bronzy color. A great to give your skin just a really nice kind of quick bronze. I usually use this either by itself, which I mean, it's amazing. I usually use this just over my fake tan or I like to use this as a primer as it is supposed to be. But some days I just can't be bothered putting foundation on. So just this is amazing. But the days that I do feel like I need a little bit of something extra, I use this as a primer and then I use my foundation on top of it. So speaking of foundations, today I've used one of my favorites, which is by Maybelline, of course, because it is amazing. And this is part of the Fit Me range. This is the Fit Me Matte and Poreless, which is for normal to oily skin, which is what I have. So this is an amazing foundation, very lightweight and very easy to use. Um, they've got a great color range as well. The one that I like to use is 220, which is natural beige, and it is a lovely lightweight consistency, nothing too heavy, doesn't make the skin look too cakey at all. Um, I just like to blend this in with some kind of synthetic brush. I just like to use one by Sigma and then just go over it with a beauty blender, which is dry, um, and it just gives you a really nice medium to full coverage. Um, absolutely love it. Cannot recommend it enough. It is amazing. For concealer recently, I've been going for something that is a little bit more lightweight, but still gives you that kind of brightness that you're after. So I've been using the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. This stuff is amazing. So I like to use the lightest color, which I believe is ivory, which is what this is called. It is rubbed off because I've used it that much. But this has a really good just stir foot applicator. Very easy to use. I just like to run this all along my under eye area, also around the center of my face, center of my nose, top of my lip, and also on my chin. And it gives you the loveliest highlighted effect. Nothing too crazy though. So just very subtle, kind of nice, not too bright. It's really good. So it is also very affordable as well, which is also a bonus. So you can pretty much get Rimmel everywhere. And I'm pretty sure 99% of us go to Priceline, which is where I usually get all these products. But Rimmel goes on sale pretty much everywhere. So if you are needing a new concealer, definitely give this one a go. Now you guys, this next product is something that if you don't have already, you need it in your life because it is amazing. And this is definitely one of my top staples in my summer kind of makeup collection. So the product that I just can't seem to get enough of is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette. Now I do have normal slash combination slash oily skin. So if you do have any of those skin types, don't be afraid of this product. Even though it does give you more of a luminous finish, it is definitely something that you guys should check out and definitely try um, because it is amazing. So I have been absolutely dying for this product and the absolute favorite color out of the palette is Radiant Light, which is this color here. I like to use this as my all over bronzer. It is a really lovely, very subtle bronzy color. Um, and because I am usually more pale toned, this suits me quite well. Um, I also really like using Dim Light as my all over setting face color and then um, incandes yep, Incandescent Light as my highlighter, which I have used a different one today, but if I'm just going for the one palette, Incandescent Light is very pretty. 
but today I've just used Radiant Light, which is the really nice bronzy color. As you can see, this bronziness all over my face is Radiant Light. Out of this palette is my go-to color that I use every single day. So if you are wanting to splurge, Christmas is coming up, definitely get this onto your bucket list or onto your Christmas wish list and hopefully someone will get it for you. Um, but yeah, definitely worth every single dollar that I spent on it because it is amazing. Now, although I did say that I am a combination to oily slash normal slash I don't know what my skin does majority of days kind of skin girl, um, I do love a good cream blush. I am a huge fan of cream blush. I think it gives you a really lovely natural flush to the cheeks. And my favorite that I've been loving for a long time now is one by NYX. And this is the NYX Rouge Cream Blush in the color Boho Chic. And it is a lovely, very lightish kind of rosy pink. I think it's going to suit absolutely everything everybody. Um, I just think it is such a beautiful color. The consistency is to die for and it just does not break up your foundation. It doesn't break up your powder or anything. It just sits on top of the skin and then you can pat it in with your fingers and it is just like heaven to work with. Highly recommend these. If you haven't tried them, you need to because they are just like, they are amazing. Like I just can't get enough of them. <laughs> Now, although this next product has unfortunately been discontinued, there is also a really good dupe for it. The product that I have been loving is the Essence Metal Glam Highlighting Powder. Now, I know that this color is very, very, very similar, if not the exact same as the Balm Mary Luminizer. So if you don't have the Essence one, the Balm one is very, very similar. They're pretty much the same product. It is exactly the same color. It's what I've used today for my highlight. I've just put it along my temples, also along the cheekbones, also down the center of my nose, tip of my nose, and also on the cupid's bow, which I could probably use a little bit more on my cupid's bow, let's be honest. It's very pretty. It's just a lovely color that I think a lot of people will suit. And um, again, yeah, you can pick the balm up now from Target and from David Jones. So definitely try it uh, because this one has been discontinued, but I'm going to purchase the balm one just because it's the Balm Mary Luminizer and I don't own it. But um, yeah, if you, you know, did get your hands on this, then that's exciting. But if not, the Balm is just exactly the same. Now, I am all about the brows when it comes to summertime, even though I like going to the beach, I like swimming, that kind of thing. Um, brows are like essential. I can't leave the house without them. So I have been setting my brows with the Essence Make Me Brow Brow Gel in the color Blondie Brows, which is number one. There's two shades to choose from. This is the lightest one, obviously, between the two. I find that it suits um, either really light brunettes or just kind of darker blondes. Obviously, my regrowth is just like insane right now but we'll ignore that but um yeah I find that it suits this kind of blonde as well but I think it's a great product it has little fibers in it that so makes your brows look nice and thick naturally and it has the tiniest little little wand on it it's super super cute and again these are only like I think it's only like five or six dollars which is amazing so if you're after a new brow gel that is slightly tinted and will make your brows look naturally amazing and then definitely give this one a go so when it comes to eyeshadow around uh, summertime, I really like going for just a really simple kind of bronzy eye just because it is super easy to do. It's a one to two shadow look and it is just super easy, very quick and it's just it's foolproof. So the eyeshadows that I've been loving to do this look, I've got on today. Um, so the first color that I like using, unfortunately it's smashed, but it is one by Makeup Geek and it is the color Creme Brulee. It is like the perfect warm <gasps> I'm pretty sure I can, oh, I'm pretty sure I can salvage that with some rubbing alcohol. I'm going to put that down. Oh, that makes me really sad. Oh. I was saying before it totally just fell out of the pan, it is the perfect warm tone brown to put in the crease area and sometimes on lazy days I just chuck it in the crease, socket, and also in the lower lash line and that's all I do. It's just a really good all round kind of color that I think is going to suit everybody. So definitely try that. And recently I've just jumped onto the ColourPop bandwagon and I picked up the color Lala which is a stunning, stunning copper color. It is like 
It is like heaven in a jar. It is such a pretty color. You can use it wet or dry. I've used it dry today on my eyelids and I find that it gives a beautiful effect. I absolutely love it. Um, but ColourPop eyeshadows are amazing and they do ship to Australia. They do charge an arm and a leg for shipping, but it's worth it. So if you are after some kick-ass eyeshadows, definitely try these because they are the bomb.com. I'm so devoured about that eyeshadow. I'm going to fix it. So when it comes to mascara, I have been absolutely loving packing on the mascara on the top lashes and having completely bare lower lashes. I find that it looks really clean and it find, I find that it looks really good on my particular lashes. I just sometimes can't be bothered doing my lower lashes and it's just a pain. So one day I just started doing it on my top lashes and not my bottom and I have just been obsessed with it ever since. So the mascara that I've been loving for that is the Maybelline Last Sensational Mascara. This is great. It has a rubber bristles brush. The Oh god. I honestly have nothing bad to say about this mascara. I think it is fantastic. It gives the best looking lashes. It gives you length. It gives you volume. It is just like the best two-in-one product. The brush is very strange but very amazing. It works wonders and I am just like, I just love it. So when it comes to lipsticks, I have three ones that I absolutely love during the summertime or the warmer months. So first one being by, actually, they're all by MAC. <laughs> um, but the first one is Pure Zen. This is a beautiful peachy pink color. I absolutely adore this color. It is more peachy tone, uh, more, yeah, it's more peachy tone than pink and it's more on the peachy nude side. Really pretty though. Um, the second one that I just cannot get enough of is cream cup and this is like my go-to everyday pink shade um so you've got pure zen and cream cup underneath there um super pretty again these are both cream sheens so they're super easy and super comfortable to wear they don't last very long in the lips but i mean they're super beautiful so you should be proud to pull it out and reapply it um but yeah very pretty colors and they're more of like the everyday colors the third color that i love is what i have on my lips today and this is lady danger this is a matte formula by MAC. I'm not going to put this on my hands because it stains. Um, so, but this is such a stunning color. Again, it is on my lips right now. Oh, I absolutely love it. You know, for a matte formula, I'm really, really loving it because I'm more of a cream cup, a uh, cream cup, more of a cream sheen kind of person. Um, and I absolutely hate matte lipsticks, but this one is very comfortable and easy to pull off. And I mean, lady danger, orangey red, it's going to suit everybody. I just cannot get enough of it. Okay, so that is all of my makeup products. Now on to the random other essentials that I just cannot live with that for summer. So I'm going to start off with tanning products because these are obviously essential for a lot of people. Um, so the brand that I absolutely love and adore is Bondi Sands and I will forever stay true to them because I love them so much. Um, so I've been loving the Bondi Sands. This is the tanning mousse, which is in the dark shade. And then on days that I feel like I need to top up my tan, I've been using the Bondi Sands. This is a liquid gold. This is the dry oil. Um, so I absolutely love these two products. These two should be just essentials for everybody because they are amazing. But to apply all of that, I really do love the Saint Tropez The Mitt. This is the best mitt that I've come across. Um, I am not a fan of the Bondi Sands one. I also hate the Model Co one. Um, any other mitt that isn't this I don't like. Um, this is just a really great mitt that I feel like everyone should try. It is a little bit expensive. I think it's $12 um, for a mitt, but I think it's great. I think it's the best mitt I think I've come across. And I can seriously get about five, about five to six tans out of this without it starting to deteriorate. So yeah, huge fan. Absolutely love it. Now, the next favorite that I just cannot live without around summertime is my sunnies. I have two particular pairs that I just seem to wear like crazy around summertime, both by Cotton On. Um, this one, oh, I mean, I love these. These are like my bug sunnies that I just can't get enough of. I just feel like like glamorous in these. I love these sunnies. I think they're great. Um, so any kind of oversized sunny that I just love. And the second pair I love is this uh, Ray-Ban inspired kind of style. I love these. One day I will buy real Ray-Bans, but for now these are 
These are great. I love these. I think they're great. They're super comfortable and I love the style. Again, I will get real Ray-Bans one day, but for now, those will do because they are super comfy and very affordable as well. These next products are so Australian of <laughs> me. Havanas or Havianas, however you want to pronounce these. These are the thin straps. I have just purchased these. I've been on the thicker straps for years and years and years and I've recently purchased the skinnier one. I'm not available. I just can't live without thongs. I'm just, I'm sorry, I'm a bogan. I love thongs. I wear thongs everywhere. Um, if I can wear thongs over normal sandals, I will do it. I'm a huge thong person. Have the Arnos all the way. Now, when it comes to bikinis, you guys know that I work at Cotton On Body and we do supply quite good bikinis. And these ones I did get last year, so I, they, I don't think they have these styles anymore, um, or at least these colors. They still have the styles, but not the same colors. But you guys can pick up the cutest bikinis for like two for $30, I think it is at the moment. Or if you go to the outlet stores, they charge two for 30 or five dollars for just the bottom so whichever one you want to do I'll show you guys a couple of my favorite pairs because I am obsessed with cute bikinis I've got this really cute pair which they still have the style just not the color um the ones with the black um on the hip super cute very pretty kind of periwinkle purple and then these <laughs> these you guys are like the cutest bottoms ever pineapples I mean, who doesn't love pineapples? I love pineapples. Pineapples are like all the thing right now and these are like, like they're, they're bikini bottoms with pineapples on them. Now, my favorite style of top for ladies with larger boobies like myself, and this is my favorite style to put on ladies with bigger boobs, um, is the triangle form because they make your boobs look really flattering and really amazing. And these are just super comfortable to wear and they make your boobs look awesome. So definitely my favorite pair. Now my last two favorites do come in conjunction with together. First one being water. I'm a huge water drinker, like huge water drinker. And if it comes in a cute bottle, I am more likely going to drink it a lot quicker. If it comes in a cute bottle, I'm just all about that kind of life, cute bottle life, you know what I mean? So this one is by Typo and I just love their water bottles. I think they're super cute. And I think this is like just under a leaf. Actually, no, it's not from Typo, sorry. It's from Ruby Shoes. I don't know how big this is. Um, I think it's about, I think it's just under a liter. I'm pretty sure, but super cute bottle. Absolutely love it. I love this print on it. I love the color as well. So water is my number one go-to drink around summertime. And the last summer essential that I have to include and is totally random is this stuff called squirt. <laughs> So mature, I know, but this is absolutely amazing. Um, around summertime, like I said, I'm a huge water drinker. Sometimes water can get a little bit boring. Let's just, you know, be honest. And sometimes I don't want to put lemon in my drink. Sometimes I don't want to put fruit in my drink. Sometimes I really just feel like cordial, but I don't want to commit to the carbs and the sugar. So Squirt is a really great alternative because it has no sugar in it as well. This is strawberry flavor. I think they've got about four flavors to choose from, which is awesome. But yeah, really exciting stuff. So what you do, I'll show you guys right now. You just open your drink up, squirt it in, and it turns your drink pink. Give it a good shake, and that's all you've got to do. Seriously, the best. Oh, I just got squirted. It's seriously better than cordial and there's no sugar and no carbs in it. It is the best thing ever. You can buy it from Woolies. It's about $4.50 a thing, which is quite expensive, but it's definitely worth it. So yeah, definitely check it out if you like cordial, but you don't want to commit to the carbs and to the sugar. So that guys completes my summer essentials, my top 20 favorites for the summer months that I just cannot live without. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, make sure to check out Brittany's channel and her Instagram. Again, all details will be linked in the description box. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.